Stop the bullshit! Stop the bullshit! Stop the bullshit! Stop the bullshit! And then you find other communities. Hello, everyone. My name is Dante Lencastre. I'm a filmmaker and activist. And I'm making a documentary about Bambi Salcedo. Pedimos una reforma migratoria e inclusiva, al igual que paren los atropellos y los abusos en la comunidad trans y gay que se encuentran en los centros de detención de ICE. I am Roland Valencia. I am a long time LGBT activist. I'm also the executive producer of this documentary. I've been hearing about Bambi for a long time, but we actually met about seven years ago. When Bambi is involved in a project, it's a project that has a stamp of approval that says this is for the community, because of the community, and by the community. What I'm going to ask you to do is to please give one another a hug and tell each other that we do own our poteria. My name is Maria Roman and I am a Latina transgender. I was fortunate enough to meet Bambi around 11 years ago. I worked at Bienestar Human Services and Bambi came as an applicant. My supervisor asked her, what do you think are the issues with the transgender community? You would think it would be like quick for her to answer and she looked at us and posed and she said, well that's a low blow. <laughs> One thing that I have learned is really two things. One to know my history, right? Es importante que sepamos nuestra historia. But most importantly, it's even more important that we don't forget where we came from. When she was about 12 years old in Guadalajara, she was walking around the park and she looked kind of androgynous. She was basically a child. And all of a sudden, there are these two men, two policemen, who just grabbed her by the hair for some reason, Bambi was able to get away. She's very fast on her feet, and that's why they call her Bambi. She's a really good example of what it means. You're not just about your circumstances, you're also about the vision that you have for yourself and for your community. Yes, I have come from darkness, and I stand before you here tonight to let you know that life, at least my life today, is definitely different. But I also want to say that the lives of many young people and the issues that they're going through are still the same as the issues that I was going through when I was young. And it's interesting to see the journey of that interview and how she was laughing without being able to put into context what the struggles of Latina transgender are and see her today in action. In our society, us transgender women are not recognized as who we are, individuals, and most importantly, as the women that we are. Where she can speak and educate hundreds of people about our issues and what the needs are for our community. So it's amazing to see her sort of transition, if you will, from point A to point B, and what a beautiful journey that has been. She has gone from living on Skid Row to having a college degree. And I think those stories are what my community needs. As a transgender woman, I need role models. I need people that I can look and say, you know what, I, that is obtainable, I can do that. And I think it is important to, to document that for future generations to see that she is one of the pioneers in this movement. I'm Bambi Salcedo and I approve this message.